Welcome to Next Steps in Reading Instruction. Today you will learn about the introduction of the vowel sound wall. To prepare for this lesson, print mouth articulation photos and graphing cards found in the lesson plan. Optional, print individual sound walls and attach to a file folder for each student. Before teaching the lesson, take time to create your vowel sound wall on a large bulletin board or a portable bulletin board. Refer to the individual vowel sound wall included in the lesson printable for placement of phonemes, mouth articulation photos, and graphemes. Vowels should be placed in a specific order, often referred to as a vowel valley. The left side should begin with the E, which causes the mouth to form a smile when producing the sound. Each vowel sound following will have a slight chin drop until you reach the AH, where the mouth will be completely open. Then you will move back up the vowel sound wall. You will notice that the mouth will round out as it reaches the U. Diphthongs are controlled and schwa vowel sounds are placed around the vowel valley. Don't introduce all graphemes at once. Graphemes should be introduced following the sequence of phonics you follow. Keep graphemes that haven't been taught covered with paper. You can also wait to place graphemes on the wall until introduced. To introduce the vowel sound wall, Choose one vowel grapheme. Guide students to look in a mirror while making the sound. Ask students questions to help them examine what their mouth is articulating. Direct students to look at the sound wall bulletin board and point to the mouth articulation picture that's making a similar shape as their own mouth. Today we're going to learn a new sound and a letter that represents that sound. This is a picture of an egg. What's the first sound that you hear in egg? Eh. Eh, very good. Can you look in this mirror and make the eh sound? Eh. What is your mouth doing when you say eh? Open. It's open. And what's your tongue doing? Eh. Notice the teacher is taking time to ask questions about the placement of the tongue, chin, lips, and mouth. We're going to look over here at our vowel sound wall. Can you help me look over here and find the picture that's saying, look at my mouth, that's saying eh? Which one do you think might be saying? The teacher guides the student to where to place the grapheme photo card. Right here is saying eh. Can you put the egg picture underneath the mouth picture that's showing eh? Put it right here. Good job. This is our individual vowel sound wall. Can you point to the picture of the egg? Good job. And can you point to the picture of it saying eh? 